All right, what's going on guys? New Force you bring a brand new video in today's video I'm bringing you guys yet another Modern Warfare Remastered video in today's video I kind of wanted to talk about an underrated weapon Now there are a ton of underrated weapons in this game, but this one to me is severely underrated Not as much as the M4 carbine but almost and that is the G36C. This thing can kill extremely quickly and extremely fast. So let's see how I do with it. Um, I'm going to play two games and then I'm going to show off the class setup that I used with this weapon. I've been doing that uh, a lot recently, showing you guys the classes that I use. And if you guys like that, just let me know and I'll continue it into World War II and stuff like that. I just feel like it really does help when I show off the classes that I use. Ow. Got a UAV, let's go. How are we barely winning? Please. I have eight kills. I'm eight and one, and we're only up by two. This is what I'm talking about when it comes to this matchmaking. Caught what? He just kept spraying. Dang it. How? We're losing the game. We're losing the game. I'm nine and three. 0-4, oh, 1-4, great team. I've been having some great teammates in these videos, man. Great teammates. But this thing can just kill so fast that I think that it's actually seriously underrated. Um, you guys can bring your own opinions down into the comment section, but I definitely think that this gun is severely underrated because I don't see a lot of people using it. So let me know if you guys have even touched this weapon at all. I definitely have. As you guys can see, I have gold on it. But that was just back when I thought I was going to get exclusion zone. But I didn't end up getting that. Come on, poke back out, please. Oh, no, I'm stuck. Oh, I got stuck. Dang it. I'm 13 and 5, dude. What do I have to do to win a game of team deathmatch? Gotta carry so hard to win just TDMs now. But I am so close to 11th prestige that if you guys see... Oh my god. That if you guys see a prestige change in this video, just let, I'm just gonna let you know that I prestiged, obviously. Um, I kind of want to show off decent gameplay just to show you guys how underrated this weapon is. And I'm gonna die because teammate is just standing there, not really... You're, UAV Jammer. <laughs> I have another annoying class setup video that I was thinking about making. You guys have really enjoyed the past two that I've made about uh, Sonic Boom, Frag Times 3, Martyrdom, and also the Juggernaut and Last Stand. Um, I really want to thank you guys for the support on those videos. They've all, they've both gotten about 150 views in uh, a day, and the Juggernaut and the Sonic Boom, Three Times Frags, and Martyrdom class setup. The heck, guy. That grenade was right next to him. Hello? Oh, you suck. You are pre-aiming me, and you're using freaking UAV jammer. You have no skill at all. It's the only way you can get kill streaks. Get destroyed. Whoa, he spawned right there. He definitely spawned right there. <laughs> Enemy helicopter. I thought I killed him. Okay, I got my own airstrike. There's a guy. He's still there. He doesn't move. I'm killing him. <sighs> teammate got him. Teammate got him. It's okay. How are we only up by three? What do I have to do? Game. Just tell me what I have to do and I'll do it, man. We're not going to win. We're not going to win. 1 and 11. Why are you still in the game? Just leave the game if you're going 1 and 11. That's what I do. I mean, I rage quit all the time. What's up, UAV Jammer? Again, dude, these kids have no skill. If you use UAV Jammer, like, and you're subscribed to me, I still I still love you, you know? But, you, uh, I'm sorry. I just, I just can't respect you as a player if you use UAV Jammer. It takes no skill to use UAV Jammer, and you guys are going to see that. In the video that I post about a UAV jammer and suppressor class, you guys are going to see just how freaking broken those perks are. Because a UAV is a kill streak. You have to go on a kill streak to get a UAV. There should not be a counter to a kill streak. 
at least the slowest kill streak in the game there shouldn't be a counter to. I understand blind eye, but the UAV, it makes no sense to counter it. It just slows down games. It just slows down games and makes people camp more. So we lost that game, even though I had over 2KD, definitely. Let's see. Yep, 27 and 13, and we still lose the game. That was a great game. It was actually a pretty fun game until the kids started pulling out uh, UAV Jammer. But that was the first game. I will catch you guys in the next one. All right, so for our second game here, we have some TDM on Ambush. Now, this is the first game of my 11th Prestige, so hopefully I can do pretty well. Hopefully they rush right down the middle so I can kill them with that grenade. Nope. You're using the M16. You have no respect for me. So now we're using it with no attachments so you guys can see the iron sights. The iron sights are actually pretty nice. Like, they're very easy to see through. Like, they're not huge, which really does help. They're not like the Fang 45's iron sights, which are freaking ginormous for no reason. Like, that gun is a submachine gun. Why are the freaking iron sights so big? I feel like I'm using an LMG when I'm using the Fang 45. Actually, I actually haven't used that weapon in a really long time. What this guy? What? Hello? I am? You're dead now. But yeah, this weapon, even without attachments, is still very nice and can kill people very easily. Because with the red dot, why would it not be able to do the same thing as it can with no attachments at all? Since this game is just so primitive which, with its attachments. Uh and I jump shotted and I still died. You're using three times frags, stopping power, and deep impact 74U class on ambush. That's fun. Three times frags is really fun. Takes a lot of skill actually to use three times frags, as you guys saw in the video called three times frags or frags times three. Sonic Boom and Martyrdom are broken. If you guys want to see that video, I will link it in the description down below. It's about how that combination is ridiculous. And I also made another video called Juggernaut plus last 10 equals too much health. Because that literally is too much health. It gives you all the all the health that you could possibly have. Which is like 126. You're in a corner! Mm, the way these people play. I haven't been able to get a gameplay with this weapon because these kids are literally playing like they're like they don't move. They don't move. People do not move. They refuse to move in this game. I don't understand. People moved back in COD 4. I don't get it. Even if I went back to go play the PS3 version of COD 4, I'm sure people would move more than they do now. I was about to shoot it down. Yeah, the MGs are really fast for shooting down helicopters, just to let you guys know. If there's ever a map with an MG and there's a helicopter in there, just go for the MG. He's in the... I thought he was... I thought he was in the little corner, like he was just sitting there. Okay. Let me throw this! Never mind, you can just one-burst me, that's cool. You're still up top camping. You're awesome. Oh, no. I think I had, like, a suppressed MP5 or something like that. Oh, you're using UAV jammer, you have no life. Okay. Ah, how did I not kill him? Let's see if this guy push me. Push me. Okay, let me get this UAV in. Ah, I got flashed. Lay down. I had no chance. That was like literally a perfect flash. I mean, sometimes you just have to give credit to people when you play. It really does just help from the raging. Like being able to just say, hey, that was, you know, just... A good throw. Where is this guy at? Okay, so I... In third person, he wasn't looking at me, but in first person, he was. Another flashbang right when I'm turning the corner. Like, those are the flashes that really catch you off guard. I have no chance to push up. You're using you. Oh, no, you're not. No, no, no. Get in the tunnel. Juke him out! I juked him. I juked him! I don't care, I juked him. Get juked. I don't care that I died, I juked that guy. Let me get this M40, maybe I can pick this guy off right here. Oh, I'm a miss. I suck. He wall banged me through that wall. That's awesome. That wall is super thin anyway. I had no chance, especially since he's using an M16. Man, these kids are nerds in this lobby, man! These kids are such nerds.
when will I be able to see my screen? Thanks, game. Oh, let's go. Get in the, get in the thing. Enemy helicopter. Great. You're dead. I need to get into the tunnel. Get into the tunnel. Get into the tunnel. Oh, I had no chance. God dang it. 15 and 11. I mean, I'm not doing terrible like this. When I can get into actual gunfights instead of dying to people that just flash me or just grenade me or something like that. I mean, I can actually get kills, but... Okay, let me get this UAV in. I have to back up with my team. Oh, this guy's going in the tunnel. How is he hitting me? What? What? I probably shouldn't have pushed up. I probably should have just waited for him to push me, but I'm not that kind of player. I'm 18 and 13. I mean, me and teammate, teammate and I, whatever you want to say, we're doing fine. This crazy Cthulhu guy was doing great when he was on the other team last game, and now he's freaking 2 and 14. You want to step into my crosshairs, please? You suck. You're terrible. You're so bad. You deserved all the tea bag that I just gave you. And we lost 75 to 52. That wasn't the best game, but as you guys can see, this weapon is actually pretty potent. It's a very good weapon. 19 and 14 isn't the best, but the first game was definitely really, really good. So hopefully you guys did enjoy the video, but in one second, I'm going to show you guys the class setup that I was using. So stay tuned for that part of the video, and I'll see you guys in that part of the video.